Hey Sag, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate it. Today we are going to find out what are your important love messages. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Okay Sag, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me. Sagittarius important love messages. Page of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Five of Wands here is in reverse. This may indicate trauma free for some of you if you've been involved in any sorts of drama, the party situation, love triangles. Spirit says to walk away from it with the chariot card here because King of Wands here is in reverse. Maybe this person is just not worth it. I feel like this has already happened in the past. And we've got the four swords, here, four swords in an upright position. Ten of uh, swords in reverse and the four wands in reverse. Hmm. This definitely indicates something that is unstable within your connection with a certain person here. This person may be somebody like you are. Sagittarius, Leo, Aries or a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Hmm. Such, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and your person, okay? Or whoever you could be thinking about or dealing with. Um, we've got the page of swords here. The truth will be revealed, I feel. Uh, communication will begin between you and somebody here. Strength card can indicate a Leo person. I feel like this can also indicate somebody holding back. Um, whoever who has been holding back from speaking with you in the past, I feel like this person is going to start communicating with you in the near future, okay? Mm. This person may talk about healing this connection with you. Feels like, yep, you were in a relationship with this person in the past for once in reverse. Both of you may have had some altercation here, or it could be a third party or a love triangle situation. But four swords can indicate sort of like a break. Somebody is uh, resting and not wanting to be a part of the drama if you were if you are right now Sag for those of you spirit says to not be a part of it okay mm, and to cut this person off because ace of swords can indicate cutting somebody off and then starting from um and starting over okay starting over because the strength card here indicates also that you need to be strong this is a really good strategy <laughs> because strength card for me it may also mean treading your situation very carefully dealing with it very tactfully all right let's see more uh, Sag. and when i say someone i'm saying it because it could either be you or this person okay you should know where you stand in the storyline so we've got the page of pentacles here yep i do sense somebody would like to offer you uh either something small your commitment or just wanting to talk to you okay and nine of swords is here this person may be a libra gemini aquarius somebody also may want to apologize to you in regards of some sort of an altercation i feel you know words that harsh words that they could have said to you in the past because it feels like this person was not thinking or somebody here is not thinking <laughs> before they spoke and we have the seven of cups here in reverse hmm. i do sense somebody is feeling sorry in regards of a choice that they have made i feel like it's a choice whether it like a very hasty or impulsive choice that they have made here in the past ace of wands here is in reverse the sun ten of wands in reverse I feel like such spirit says, you know, if there's a connection that's no longer um, your responsibilities, it's not your burden to carry. Um, I don't know. It just feels like spirit's trying to say to 
just leave it okay and the sun is right here ace of wands here is in reverse i don't know why i just feel like somebody you may be receiving a message from somebody whom either you have rejected in the past or they could have rejected you in the past we've got the sun here something is going to be made really really clear to you or to this person Mm, through some sort of communication or information that you'll be getting or this person will be getting okay again roles can be reversed but i definitely see a new beginning coming up for you guys uh a sag when it comes to love especially if you are single if you're single feels like there could be somebody uh whom is going to offer you something this person may be really friendly could be a virgo capcom or taurus i feel like this person they speak very carefully. I hope that makes sense to you because they don't want to hurt your feelings. This is somebody who has money as well. Uh, very loyal, very stable. If you haven't met this person yet, you, you wouldn't know who this person is. But I feel like some of you maybe have already met this person because it's actually sitting in your future position, right? So yeah, some of you maybe you have already met this person, some of you haven't yet. And this is also a general reading, so divine timing for each and every one of you is different. So we've got the tower here in reverse. <clears throat> the Hierophant is in reverse, Nine of Cups in reverse. I sense somebody is also avoiding a permanent ending for some of you. Because it seems like there could be some issues within this connection. Ten of Swords in reverse and the tower. Somebody may be saying sorry in the nick of time before you actually completely move on complete uh, you actually move on completely or vice versa. And the hierophant here is in my first nine of cups in my first. Definitely sense an apology coming on such someone whom could have made you really unhappy, broken their promises here with the hierophant in my first. Let's see more. Yeah. Definitely promise something here. Someone could have promised somebody something solid, but it didn't take off. Something has been brought to light with the sun here. And that could be a lot of anger with the Knight of Swords. And someone deciding to move on. Hmm. And Seven of Wands is here. You could be trying to protect yourself from getting hurt. Or vice versa and nine of swords is in reverse someone is thinking about contemplating in regards to finally speaking with you i see communication coming in that's for sure because page is a messenger ace of swords sword is also some sort of a communication and the sun here i feel like because the sun is being surrounded by not too positive cards so i feel it has more to do with something being brought to light that could have caused somebody being really angry here with the knight of swords and with the king of wands here reverse if this is you um i feel like spirit is definitely saying to turn your back on this person whoever who has made you really unhappy here and to move forward let's see a bit more such so king of pentacles here is in reverse you got the king and the queen here one person may have either been inconsistent i feel like these two are the same people right or it could also indicate two options for some of you coming up two options where you will have to make a choice here in regards to your future with a ten of cups hmm. some of you it's whether to return to somebody from your past or move forward or it could be somebody you could be dealing with this person maybe maybe trying to make a choice whether they should choose somebody from their past or to choose you either or but I feel like a choice will be chosen. Uh, somebody will be chosen here because Ace of Swords. You know, Ace of Swords indicates somebody needing to cut something off, somebody off from um, their past or could be an existing person and then have this new beginning with somebody else, with you or you with somebody else, okay? Hmm. 
I definitely see a chance of somebody here. I feel like it's this person offering it to you. This person most likely is a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. All right, Sagittarius, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, <clears throat> please hit like, share, and subscribe. Sorry, I'm losing my voice. <laughs> And I'm going to leave you with um, two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my travel vlog channel and the second one is from this channel. And yep, there are readings over there, uh, recent readings, if you guys like to check it out. And Saj, I hope to see you um, again soon. Take care. Bye.